uh, there's a flip side to the Arrow kind of fandom in that it can go too far, mm -hmm. you think? I think that there's sections of the fandom that take to liking another character by way of attacking, by liking a certain character by way of attacking another character. All that being said, I think that uh, Twitter largely is overblown. I'm not saying that these people aren't passionate and I'm not saying that their opinion shouldn't matter, but I do think that their voices tend to be so loud that we think that the crowd is much bigger than it actually is. I, I happen to think that it's, that it's much smaller, that I think most people still enjoy a show in the traditional way, which is to watch it and not to, not to <laughs> tweet constantly throughout it. But that, that being said, you know, the internet can be a negative place. The reason that I don't consider Twitter to be a very viable social media platform is because there's no accountability. There's no requirement yeah. for anything but anonymity. And that's not to say that people can't have good opinions there, but I think, I think largely it's noise. What's your relationship with fans in real life? Oh, couldn't be better. And that's why I don't take stuff like Twitter that, that seriously. Because the people that I meet, if they're passionate about the show in a positive or a negative way, they, they, they reason their position out to me in, in a very relaxed, calm way that's much longer than 140 characters. <laughs> and then we can talk about it. But I, I, think, it. I think ultimately having passion one way or another about a show is important. At Vicky via our blog, does the amount of hatred on social media that's directed to everyone from Mark Guggenheim to the writers and even death threats to the cast surprise you? I enjoy the show, but I try to stay away from social media regarding Arrow because it's gotten so nasty. It has. Why has it gotten so nasty? Because it's, Why? It's, it's gotten it's gotten decidedly negative because for whatever reason, different different you know people that are fans of the show have seemed to split up into different factions. But again, I, I, I really do think that it's, that it's a, a few people with very loud voices. And I feel like if you're going on the attack for fictional characters that you're probably not real fans of the show. Watch new episodes of Larry King Now, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday on demand on Aura TV and Hulu.